ویلکمٹرپریٹرٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹرپریٹ
then I will write here uh, shift 9 to add this uh, curly bracket uh, round bracket now uh, shift 2 these um, double quotation marks within double quotation uh, these co quotation marks I will write here double quotes I will write um, first I'm going to write my first statement hello world okay then after writing hello world press simple enter button from your keyboard it will execute your first instruction successfully now write I'm going to print this message hello friends how are you double quotation close close the round bracket and this is the main syntax of the printing any message whatever you will write in within double quote it will print as it is so let me execute this done successfully now you have learned how to uh, print message using python language um, okay using print function this is a print function predefined function okay uh, let's go uh, further now I'm going to declare a variable what is variable variable is a block uh, is a block um, is, a, is a block where you store uh, your data what kind of data what is data data is your name your age your height your phone number your address number th these all are called data when we will process the data it will become information so data information clear so let's uh, declare our first variable uh, in uh, Python language um, Python is very easy and very interesting uh, language uh, but it, it has no um, such kind of uh, keywords which we will use to create a variable so whenever I will uh, for example I want to store my name I will write first name first name why I have given spaces between first name uh, first word and the second word I have I haven't given uh, spaces between here because if I give a space here I will get a syntax error let me show you the, this is the rules of declaring variables now is equal to his assignment operator now within double quote I will assign a string my name Faisal space Jalil okay space is also a special character now within double quote I am I have written this so Python will automatically convert this into a string type data type so it's uh, data type should be this variable data type should be string so when I will click on run I will get a syntax error hopefully because I'm not following the protocols of this programming language protocol means rules of the programming language yes I got syntax error what is syntax error when you are not following the rules of the programming language now let me write again first now I'm going to uh, without space I will write name now I will again double quote I will write Faisal Jalil uh, double quotation close enter done no error okay gee. now let's print my name print now I want to I have stored my name in the, that variable now I'm going to print its value using variable I'm going to print whatever I have stored in this variable so enter and it will display my name okay if what if I will use this print and within double code I will write this variable double quotation uh, round bracket close what if look here I have declared this variable first name is the same variable name without quotation uh, double quotation uh, I have written here within in these round brackets and he has given me actual value but when I will write double quotation it will give me what it will print the message as it is so you got it what's the distance between using in the print function double quotation and without double quotation okay now next thing is um, now let's create multiple variables like uh, I want to store number so I will declare a meaningful variable like num num1 let's say num1 is equal to I'm going to assign 15 here okay then I want to declare another number I want to add two numbers so I will create another number 2 so num2 is equal to let's say um, let's say 10 okay done now I want to uh, add these two numbers so I need another variable where I will store 
the result so i'm using variable like uh, sum is a keyword so i'm not going to use that i will use here result is equal to uh, i can say a uh, num whatever i have stored in num1 add num1 plus num2 done let's see what we'll get is it give me value or it will join these two numbers okay i'm printing the value here using print function yes i got my result successfully that's how you will add uh, operators using uh, you can change this operator to by applying other basics operation like uh, multiplication addition subtraction and all that okay next thing is uh, what if i want to apply a same number to multiple variables for example same value to multiple variables so i will write here num1 is equal to num2 is equal to 10 this instruction shows that k okay, i have assigned 10 to num1 num2 and num1 declare two variable and assign 10 declaration and assignment done over here so let's see i'm going to print only print num1 close the bracket enter now what we have in print num2 let's see enter uh why he's giving me error over here okay error is print is not defined so i have uh, used a um, capital letter over here so it's a case sensitive we have to use small letters okay now i will write num2 enter successfully got it now after this uh, the multiple uh, assign uh, value assignment clear okay now uh, how to assign a value to multiple variables different values okay the same variable same numbers i have assigned to these two uh, variables num1 and num2 what if i want to declare three variables num1 okay uh, then i will write comma then i will write num2 num2 means number two some meaningful variables you can create like that num3 i have now three variables now i want to assign different numbers to these variables so here i will write uh, three comma four comma five okay let's see now i want to print these numbers one by one for example what i have in num1 enter three okay first number assigned to num1 so what if i write over here print num2 use the same variables yes now i'm going to write print num3 okay beta this is the way to uh assign uh, declare multiple variables by uh, by using this comma as a separator and assign these multiple uh, different va uh, values to these variables okay uh, after that uh, hopefully you are practicing this okay now next thing is uh, what if i want to take um, input from the user input from the user I want to take input from the user so I will write here num1 is equal to so I will use input function no I want to take uh, my name from the user okay let's enter the name first okay full name full name is what it's a variable it's a meaningful variable now I will use input function input round bracket again okay then in input bracket i will write a message for the user please enter your full name okay double quotation close and then um, i can even give a colon here r is equal to sign now i will close this bracket now press enter 
now he is asking is printing this message whatever ever i have written with an input function now is uh, now user is asking from uh, the user please enter your full name so i will write here faisal jalil enter done now faisal jalil is saved in which variable full name now i want to print this result using print function so here i will write the same variable and close the bracket and press enter beta till here you have to practice students and everyone thank you very much for watching uh, stay tuned um, I will, in the next video i will show you how to apply some basic operation multiplication addition subtraction and all that and how to calculate the percentage and all other functions okay uh this was just basic uh, tutorial if you like it uh, if you like this tutorial please uh, subscribe my channel and please comment for the suggestion thank you very much take care allah face long live pakistan